Hello guys, welcome back to FNAF World. Today we're gonna just continue where we left off. We were about ready to talk to Fred Bear, but I ended the episode because I'm an epic gamer. So, so go over to him. You've reached Lily Gear Lake. From here, I don't know where your adventure will take you. You should be keeping your eyes open for another glitched object. They are the only way to get to places that are otherwise unreachable. Be careful in the waters of Lily Gear Lake. I hear there's a sea monster that attacks at random. Be ready to fight. Good luck. Yes, well everything attacks at random, doesn't it? The one who pulls the strings is always watching. He allows you to progress. Follow the trail that they have created for you. Play along. There is another mine that you must find before you enter the glitched object. Find the claw. Okay, well now we are going to go into Lily Gear Lake and here are three colossals, which I don't know how hard these guys are, so let's just fight them. Okay, well they don't seem to do too much damage to me, but I don't do too much damage to them either. As they just proceed to kill one of my animatronics. Well, we got one. There we go. 25 fast tokens too. Okay, we'll go over here in this mine. And, yeah, if you go this way. Go down and then up. And then go down some more. The clock should be around here. Yep, there we go. And you have to click on the middle, well, stand on the middle one, because that's the same code from the FNAF 3 tile sequence. Okay, well, anyway, I'm just going to teleport out of there. And then head back up and go this way. Once you get up here, head down here to this glitch tree right here. And this is where you progress to the next part. Okay, and then this will take you to the cemetery. Go over here and open that up. Then talk to Fred Bear again. This is a horribly spooky place. I think I'll stay right here. You however need to keep going. This is a graveyard for broken and unwanted creations. It's full of nastiness and traps. I don't think everything here is as it seems. Check the graves and the trees. This whole place is full of illusion. One thing is true. Nothing here is as it seems. You need to find another clock, but the passage will not be easy. There's a secret sub-corridor that leads to Pinwell Circus under this graveyard. Find the clock. Everything else is a deception. Okay, there is one thing I want to do first, though. Is if you go over here in the water area, go up here, and you can go through this part, and this will lead you into here, and in here, there's a lull bit. And in here, they have... Mini FO, UFO, and XFO, which I want to get an XFO. Because that's essentially the wasp thing that I have, except better. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to try and save up for that. Maybe just play around for a bit and see if I can get that. On the bright side, there's not a clock for me to find this time. I get to wait until the next Fred Dare incident. But for now, I'm going to try and get this pearl again for some more coins. Okay, I can at least get one of those 50 ones. I will just cut back with you guys, and for right now, I'm just going to grind around and see if I can get enough coins for that UFO before I progress. Oop, new challenger. JJ. JJ's not very good, but, you know... Like I said last episode, I am trying to get possibly all the animatronics, but... I mean, I'm not necessarily going to go out of my way to grind for them, but, like, I'm not going to run away either. Okay, well you see, technically I didn't get enough for the top one, except I am just going to get the 500 coin one for now. I just will save up for the next one later on. But even this one will help. Okay, well now I'm just going to continue on with the story here. Um, actually first I will get this chip, which is block jump scare, which I'm not going to use, but nice to have if I need it. But go down here. And through this bush, and we have to go into this mine to go to the glitched area. Go over here, and this tombstone, even though you can't really realize it, it is glitched.
and we made it into here. So, one last thing I do want to do this episode is I'm going to buy the mini FO also, just because I have an extra slot for it. That'll be it for this time, guys. I know it was somewhat short, probably, but, like, this is going to be a somewhat short series, but, you know, peace out.